Amaius' Bree McLean led all scorers with four goals in a dominant victory against the Spartans over the weekend. However, defense on both sides Tuesday night found goals hard to come by, especially for the visitors early on. Freedom coming out with high energy and attack on its home turf. Paige Jenkins scoring two of the first four unanswered goals from the Pates. That four to nothing run came by four straight free position goals. The final from Kari Van Dever to open the four to zero advantage through the first three minutes of play. Emmaus ending that scoring drought thanks to back-to-back -back scores from Emily Hollinger. Mila Weber finds the cutting Hollinger for her second of three scores on the night. That trimming Freedom's lead to just two. However, two more from the Pates puts them back up by four. This time it's Janelle Karabinas on the high finish off the assist from Paige Teletovic to lead it now six to two. Freedom remains in front at the break up by two at halftime. Brianna McLean found the back of the net with 15 left in regulation to cut the deficit to just one. That her second score on the night off the find from Hollinger. Emmaus will tie it up for the first time all game on a Jordan Pole free position fake out. It's a 7-7 ball game now with under 10 to play. However, the game winner coming from none other than Teletovic, the senior midi with two goals and a helper. Hornets with a chance in the final 20 seconds. McLean on the free position. Teletovic gets the stick on it, and Ariana O'Keefe gathers it for the Pates. O'Keefe finished with nine saves for the home team as she preserves the win, an 8-7 victory for the yellow and black. We knew we had to win, and we just brought the energy. We knew that if we all came together, we could win. And it was just the energy and everyone like lifting up each other. And I'm just so proud of like everyone. I'm just, it feels great. So, you know, we had a little bit of a rocky start up and down, kind of inconsistent. Um, our team is pretty young. We're still building that chemistry, still trying to get it going. But I think this is a great win for us. It's a positive win moving forward. And, you know, it's exciting for postseason because that kind of secured our spot. Certainly some ups and downs for the Pates this season, but attacking this tough part of their schedule head on, now winning their third straight and also handing Emmaus their first league loss of the season. For sure, we obviously started off not the best way we wanted to. I think that we also have four games um, this week, so we have two out of the way, two wins already. We want to finish this week strong and that'll really help with, um, you know, just boosting us up. From Freedom, I'm Cassie Schmidt reporting for the FC Network.